Welcome to the greatest block in the history of Soho. I'm about to take you into one of the coolest lofts, and I'm sorry I'm gonna say that a lot, I just have to because it is what it is, at 16 Crosby Street. This is gonna blow your mind, let's go. Welcome to quintessential Soho. One of my most favorite lofts I've ever seen in my career. We've got 10 foot windows overlooking Crosby Street where we just were, and there's so many beautiful details here. 14 foot ceilings, classic cast iron historic architecture, heart of one of the most exciting neighborhoods in the world, not just New York City, that I don't even know where to start. Like, Look around, <laughs> where would you start, you know? But start, in the, but start in the living space. If I were to just Google Soho Loft, this is what comes up in my mind. And even in my mind, I couldn't imagine something as beautiful as this that could also house a massive regulation ping pong table, or that would have this beautiful built-in banquette, right? How amazing is this? Even the cushions are so soft to the touch. And I don't know if you can tell yet, but it is so, so quiet in this home because where we're located right now at the base of Crosby Street has no traffic. We're at the beginning of a street here, cobblestones. There's no traffic here. You have to loop around and get here, which makes it perfect for living here. There's no trucks, there's no buses. You're very, very quiet. And then your three sleeping areas are incredibly flexible. And then they're in the back. So you get all the light that's coming from the front and you're sleeping perfectly quietly in the back. But before we get there, let's go to the kitchen. Now I'm six foot three. Most kitchens I look tall in, except for this one. This kitchen really shows you how much height we're dealing with here. Like how much air we have in this space. There's no claustrophobia in here. This isn't your classic loft with eight or nine foot ceilings. These are over 14 feet. These are classic cast iron beams here. And look how beautiful these finishes are. From the black cabinetry that's all custom to the gorgeous, gorgeous white countertops. You have a suite of melee appliances. And then there's little details here too, like you're cooking, you're entertaining. You don't want to have your faucets. So you pull it up, right? And then you've got your faucet. And then when you want to clean it, you push it down, put it away. And it's almost like a little art piece, little details like that. These owners thought of when they were renovating this home because they wanted it to be perfect. And I will tell you, it feels perfect to me. It's amazing breakfast bar, even the flooring as it highlights the lighting, it keeps it warm. We've got the stark white of the tin ceilings and then you've got the warm feeling on the floor. It works really, really well. So let's look at the sleeping spaces, shall we? Let's start with this one. So this is our den. You can just imagine myself sitting here and watching this property tour on YouTube just by myself, ready to go. But what's amazing about this space is that this is your den. It's centered here. This, I think might be, no, it's not alive. This is not alive. This is, this is furniture. This easily closes off. These are all sliding doors. And then you've got the curtains and this easily becomes a second or third bedroom. And then you've got the other sleeping area back here. Down the hallway, we've got our powder room here. The apartment has three sleeping areas, two and a half bathrooms, and that living room is 750 square feet. It's big, extra big. Great closet space. You've got these amazing ceilings, speakers fully built in. We even have bonus space up here because these ceilings are so high. I mean, look how awesome this is. Like, if you have kids, how cool this is. It's like your little clubhouse. It's like your own tree house in Soho. You've got glass windows here that are allowing all the light to come in from the front. Or I would just come up here and I would do work. Put a desk up here. You take phone calls or it's storage space, sure. But come on, you gotta get creative. This is so much fun. They even got this glass ceiling here. We just hang out. But 
as we get to our primary, we've got our coffee, tea, and alcohol bar. Anything you could potentially want to drink is here. And then before I forget, downstairs, we have a storage room, but it's more than that. It's over 300 square feet, separately air conditioned, and it can easily be used as a gym or a home office or storage, but it's bonus space separate from your home that comes in this building. How cool is that? And then this is our primary suite. We've got walk around closets here, a big walk-in closet there, desk space, it's so gorgeous, it's so cool. It's a mixture of Bohemian, there's a mixture of Beverly Hills in here. You know, there's a mixture of, of so many different, some, some corners I feel like I'm in Paris, some corners I feel like I know I'm absolutely in New York, and then I look out these windows, that gorgeous glass, the light reflecting, coming in all day long, and we know exactly where we are on Crosby Street in the heart of Soho. Gorgeous primary bathroom, and that's not all. One of the big, big benefits of this building and this unit is that the monthly charges here, right, as a co-op, are just about $900 a month, and that's it. Because this building collects income from the retail tenant below, and so your monthly charges are offset. It's a savings, annualized, of about $5,000 a month if you live here versus another comparable Soho loft which over the course of the next five years is $300,000 in your pocket that ordinarily would go to the building in terms of a maintenance fee. It's an amazing, amazing value. And you also get to live here in this home. This is 16 Crosby, Loft 2RN. Thank you so much for watching.